In this video, we we'll show you how Ray V20 subroutine and Atlas T20 subroutine can work together to provide a more seamless beam workflow from design to fabrication. Ray V20 subroutine is delivered with 35 families and you can access the properties of a structural member with the edit type button. One of the new announcements in Ray V20 subroutine is the ability to place steel connections directly on the structural sections in your Revit model. You can download and install the Autodesk Steel Connections from your Autodesk account. The Steel Connections for Revit provide access to a variety of parametric steel connections, enabling connections to be modeled with a higher level of detail. If you want to insert a steel connection in your model, just pick the different members to be connected, then select the connections command and a list of available steel connections will appear in the pull-down list under General Connection in the Properties palette. By navigating through the different options offered in the Properties dialog box, it is easy to adjust the connection by defining a different end plate size or modifying the stiffness quantity. Changing the length of the arch will immediately affect the location of the stiffness along the beam.